Oh, that was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't buy a ticket, you do not win the ticket, as they say. Pretty sure that's wrong. Hello, welcome along to uh, Radio Yorkshire Predicts uh, Leeds United versus Burton Albion. Uh, the two Toms once again to myself, Tom Maguire, Tom Cardiff. Hello. 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 We never do that. We never say hello to each other. Yeah, we may as well. We always ask how we're doing. Good. Yeah, yeah, that's that. Yeah. All right, well, back from the international break. I know you're happy about that. We're going to preview the game using FIFA 17 again. 18 still not here, so bear with us regarding the teams and stuff like that. But first... The coin flip. The coin flip. Two P coins gone downhill. I mean, it's just the first coin I got out All of my right, wallet. Fair enough. Fair enough. Very, fair enough. I'm, I'm, right, I'm, okay. a, I'm a very potless man. Right, I'm going to flip it. You call yeah. it in the air. All right. Fair enough. Yeah. And you can choose whether you. I'd imagine you choose Leeds. Probably. Yeah. Okay. All right. Tails. It is tails. Leeds. <laughs> oh no. Because Burton are rubbish. It seems like everyone. Darren had. Um, a fan on for Fan Thursday. They were all predicting like 3-0, 4-0, 5-0. Yeah. Why is why is Burton that bad? Uh, oh, I did a goal. Uh, because they got hammered away at Hull on the road. They've been a bit shaky. Hull, who've come from the Premier League. And are still a bit rubbish. They're only, they're only hammering the rubbish teams. They're, you've got a problem with your controller. That's what I think. I'm stuck. Come on. All right, excuse right, okay. you. Anyway, uh, so yeah. Uh, East Point yeah. Arena looking fine as ever. <laughs> Everyone is predicting that Leeds will want this because they will keep their unbeaten run going. But the thing is, Leeds of the you know the past couple of years, maybe maybe less so under Gary Monk, expectations where you're expected to win are the games that Leeds lost. I.e. Yes. Burton last year at the back end of last season. Yeah, they bottled the back end of last season, though, didn't they, under Monk? However, you'd hope... You'd hope that um, that they've kind of learnt lessons from Preston early, like obviously the first home game where they just couldn't break them down. You reckon Burton and Nigel Clough might come and do the same. They'll be happy just to take it a bit, you know, and try and get a point. So hopefully Leeds have learnt the lessons, be able to break them, break them down if they are to kind of come up shop shop, which is fair enough. Um, so yeah, we'll wait and see. Of course, Burton have got a fair few loanees. Sean Scannell, one of them, yeah. and we've put them, him into the starting squad. We've tried to guess what we think the starting squads will be. So, Pretty similar for to instance, the last game. Yeah, yeah, but Lusaga starts for Leeds. Like, no Luke Murphy for Burton, who yeah. you imagine will be in and eligible to play. Uh, I've gone ball for Jackson, just because he's a natural left back. For uh, Lusaga, yes, who seems to want to play even if his wife's given birth. So <laughs> yeah, no. we will wait and see on that one. Um, so yeah. You'd expect him to to come in to the squad, uh, despite Roof obviously doing well. Whether that'll be enough for Roof to retain his starting place, I'm not too sure. Um, but oh, well, nearly all right. a dream you, debut. You'd be from hoping Saga. he does not do that. Yeah. Um, yeah. But interesting, yeah. Um, it's good to be honest. If you put Lasaga in, it's you know good for him because he'll want to get the goals going against a team like Burton who. You know, if you want to be up there, you've got to be looking to score goals against teams like this. Uh, or Roof, who's just in great form at the moment, so it's a good choice for Leeds to have. Now, when uh, Nigel Clough has come to uh, Ellen Road in the past, he's all, before uh, coming with Burton, tended to do pretty well, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh no! no! Oh. I feel nervous. God, <laughs> this is... You, you want Leeds to start like this, wouldn't you? Janssen! Oh! Um, imagine, imagine if Janssen scored a screamer like that. Yeah. I think Ellen Road would probably just. That's it. That's Ellen it. Road is shut. That's they, it. You will not get a greater give, moment. Give Leeds the title. Unless um, Berardi scores. Oh, no, well, a this, bicycle kick. This is the issue. You know, going on for about. Playoffs. <laughs> at Wembley. Um, <laughs> I think, um, you know, the issue of the, the penalty taker, obviously, we know Chris Wood anymore. Oh, yeah, who will be? The um, they, I think there's quite a lot of options. It's a shame that we haven't got. Uh, good, um, what's his name uh, now? Uh, Giuseppe Belushi, who just goes, listen, I've got this. I've got this, I've, I've got, got this. this. Oh, Rosehead, apart from one time at Bournemouth, and because of that, he think, thought he could do it every time. What about Berardi? Well, obviously he's... Give it to him, he ain't scored yet, has he? Yeah, Never, he's ever. Still, he's still injured, isn't he? Yeah, but I don't mean it immediately. Oh, like, right, long okay. Run. Okay. Berardi. Maybe. Get him, get him a goal. I don't know, maybe you need your natural striker or something I think to do it. I think you'd so. like La Soga, wouldn't you, to have it? Hello? Well, no, wrong with that. Oh, that. Well, no, wrong with that. You'd like La Soga to have it, wouldn't you, I think... The more goals thing, he though, right? gets, you've, the better. You've, you've said Lasoga and Lasogo, right? Yeah. Which one is it? Uh, it is. Uh, I don't let me focus. 
Uh, it's Lasoga, I think, because it's double, uh, it's log a. Uh. There's two G's in there. Oh, hang on, you can catch me out here. Oh, no. Good oh, save, Felix. Good save, Felix. Um, but I was just trying to score, so I was kind of really focusing on pronunciation. Oh, what? Are, what are you doing? All Hello. Right. Oh, go over. <laughs> okay. So, penalties aside, goals have been coming very, very well from the midfield yes. before the international break. Yes. You expect it to carry on, really, aren't you? We just, oh, what's, what's he doing, Felix? <laughs> Someone finish it! No. Oh my word, what are you doing? But um, interesting to to obviously see if they can carry it. They, you'd expect them to, because oh. Saiz and uh, Alioski have been two key players early on. It's usually me doing all the fouls. To be fair, right, mine aren't slide tackles. Mine are just like... Oh yeah. That's it. Whereas you, clothes lines yeah. from hell, like JBL. No, yeah, leg breaking. That's just rhymed. I didn't, re I didn't never realise that until now. Leg break has never hurt anyone. Oh! I think we've had a couple of screamers since we've been doing these, haven't we? You need to calm down, so think, right? Just, what, what's what? wrong with a tapping? Oh, a little shit. sweaty gold tapping. They're no fun, are they? Oh, come on! Now you see that? Come that's on! That's a yellow! It's got to be! How is that a yellow? Ezran deserves a yellow. Just, Ref, you're a disgrace. Yes, there you go. Just calm it down. Calm it down. But yeah, coming back to, his, um, to Alioski and Samuel Says, they've hit the ground running haven't they yes Leeds. Yeah. and it seems like Victor Orta has done a grand job bringing everyone together yeah um, oh oh, oh. Um, yeah it's they're, they've settled in a lot quicker um, than uh, than probably most expected I think um, honestly well, I didn't know what you were doing there I was trying to be cocky I'll be honest with you um so yeah, it's great. Uh, they've really hit the ground running. Already become fan favourites. Um, so yeah, I said that in my in my piece in the Burton Mail actually. You mean speak to the Burton Mail? I've been in the Burton Mail. Really? Yeah, yeah. Good for you. It's online. I think it's I online know. today. Oh yes, I can't remember. Well, if you're uh, if you're after some pre-match reading, yeah. uh, before Leeds United live, one thirty yes. on uh, Saturday. Yes. Burton Mail. Burton not, Mail. Not bad. Never mind the YEP with yeah. Phil A. Yeah, because you know Phil's just just fantastic, and we expect great things. <laughs> So Phil obviously builds it up and I just come in and knock it right now. I love Phil here, right? He's a nice guy. Yeah. I, I, but if he I, I beats don't know me... Why, I don't no, know why, why you've had to throw that let, in there. Let me, if he beats me to, be in the, to tweet in the team news one more time this season, I'm going to be really annoyed because I'm always oh! trying to beat him to it. He can't though, can he? he can't, yeah. can't beat the Phil here. Um, that's a really weird part of conversation right there. I've got... I won the ball there. I won the ball. Oh my That's god. That's got to be if if not a red, a yellow. Red, minimum, you daft. It's got to be. You red, um, you daft. Last man. Was he on last, last man? man are you was he? Behave. Is that the side of the box? I had tunnel vision. <laughs> I had tunnel vision. I was what, ready chuckle for chuckle vision. Chuckle, chuckle vision. Ch chuckle vision. Look at that. Look at that free. tackle. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, I think I won the ball. To be fair, I think you won nothing. Right, let's try it. I want a right-footed person. Not one of these have got good stats. The, the Olympics is Marvin Sordell there. Went to the Olympics, remember? Right. Did he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was Great Britain's forward, wasn't he? Remember that, 2012. Fairly sure is Marvin Sordell. Is that true? I'm fairly sure. You can Google Let's it. Let in the comments. You can Google it. Okay. Oh, I don't know where to go. not liking this attacking spell that Burton are having. Ah, oh, Felix there again. Yeah, you did okay enough. Put him in, but it's interesting to see if he does... Uh, What's going on? Does um, where are you going? Does start with obviously his uh, injury during the internationals. Uh, I think it pulled him out of the Ireland squad, didn't it? Yes, <laughs> that's one man you definitely want to start with. His no hair on this game. Well, he was which... bald when he was at um, Huesca. Yeah, looks better now. Like, so much better. Looks so, so much better. better. It's not like Alioski's hair, which is just Tesco bleached. <laughs> it's just a bit much. Other supermarkets bleaches are available. Yeah, but true. why on FIFA does Pablo Hernandez have Pablo H? Don't Not know. Hernandez. Never know. No, never noticed that. Yeah. Um, you were talking about Union okay and obviously injured. Right, we've watched it now. Can you skip it? All right, you good scored. Good, good well goal done. Good goal. Lad. Um. Yeah, well, he's injured, isn't he? Well, um, yeah, I'm not sure. He picked up a knock, I think, with Ireland, didn't he? So he, I don't know if he'll start, but then. 
obviously with the amount of midfield choice I think Leeds can afford injuries I know it, they never want them but they can probably afford them uh, this season just because the amount of quality they've got in that position don't you dare oh my god <sighs> you got me distracted talking about injuries I see your game I think it is, it is a bit of a big loss because Union's sort of kind of been thriving under Thomas Christensen though. Yeah, yeah. So, but we'll wait and see. Obviously, we'll wait and see. He's really got under the radar. Been putting some great performances. Um, as of most of the team, to be fair. Yeah. Right. I've just remembered as well though. Oh, we're no, talking wait, about Lasaga. Yeah. Um, we didn't actually talk about. Um, is it Pavel? Pavel Chibiki? Uh, it's Chibitsky. Chibitsky. Uh, my apparently. Apologies. Apparently so, um, um, but yeah, we haven't really discussed him. Not you've not put him in the starting lineup. Uh, yeah, um, have I've you put, put him on the bench? No, I put J Roy Grot there. I think he might be involved. I don't know. I just don't know whether they'll give him a bit more time to kind of settle in with a team, with a group, no whatever. One. What are you doing, lads? Come on, um, bro. come on, the Brewers. I know nicknames. All oh, right, down with the kids. Um, so yeah, we'll have to wait and see on that one. What, what happens, but. Again, it's options, isn't it? It's options there. Oh, you don't see me flying in like that. You are a disgrace. Get him off. Um, so, yeah, we'll, we'll kind of have to wait and see on it and, and what happens. But You're not going from goal from there, are you? Oh, yeah, why not? Los Angeles got 87 power. Let's have this. Well, that'll be worth it. <laughs> <laughs> You don't buy a ticket, you do not win the ticket, as they say. Pretty sure that's wrong. <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah, Chibiki, not Chibitsky. Chib Chibitsky, I think it is. Right, okay. If we break it down. Right, either way, he's not in your um, thing, and uh, not in, even on your bench, but... Nothing against him. Gerard Grot is. Yeah, I think just maybe giving him, obviously, a bit more time... What, ref? Uh, a bit more time to, to settle in, of course, and... Yeah, he could be involved, he could not, but I don't know. Um, whether Burton at home is a game to get him involved into, obviously maybe give him the opportunity to to uh, get a goal or two of the Ekiban out on the long-term injury list. So we'll, yeah. we'll wait and see. Has he had surgery or have I read that wrong? Uh, he has, yes. He's out for a couple of months, I think. That's a shame. Yeah. Oof. So first half, 1-1. One, one. Yeah. Game live on uh, Radio Yorkshire, DAB Digital Radio on Saturday. Mark Wilson, Redders and Stats. One thirty hour build-up starts. And if it was 1-1 at half-time, I think many of the Ellen Road faithful will be a bit going, it's supposed mm. to be an easy win, this. Mm. Yeah, it'd, be, it'd start with like the Preston, I think, at home. It depends how Leeds play, because you've had more shots than me. I've had one shot on target, but crit critical, crucial, what's the word? Crucial. Crucially. Mine Critical. Have, you, your one has gone on, gone in. Something like that. Grammar, we has it. Um, but 1-1, one, yeah, one, yeah. like I say, at half-time. Ellen Road. An expectant Ellen Road. Yeah. Would they be, yeah. Happy, be happy with that, would they? Uh, I wouldn't say so, but it depends how Leeds play. It all depends how Leeds play. If Leeds are all over Burton, and it's, Burton have had one chance and taken it, but it looks, you know, all Leeds. Then, all Leeds, aren't we? Yeah, exactly. Um, then I think it'd be okay. It just depends... On kind of the performance as well, but hopefully, yeah. leads will be ahead. Okay. What have you made of the uh, international break? Then do you think it will have helped or hindered Leeds? Um, it's a bit of both, really. I think. Um, oh, oh, hello. He's that taken the player great first. Tackle. That was a great tackle. The last tackle. Watch the last tackle. Proper Get in. Oh. Um, <laughs> plug. Um, I don't know, I think they wouldn't have wanted it because they were hitting a bit of form, but then I suppose it is a decent... Oh! oh it's another corner game. Uh, what? <laughs> uh, but then it's obviously a chance to rest, recuperate. You don't want to burn out too much. Leeds play obviously quite high-intensity type football at times, especially away from home. Um, so, yeah, it, it's had its advantages, disadvantages. I just think, oh, well, um, the, with the way Leeds were going... I don't think they'd ever wanted an international break to come, to be honest. Yeah, fair point. Although it was uh, Forest last uh, time that you were f facing out against us, um, Leeds. I didn't, I'm really not making sense there. I'm no, trying no. to defend as well. Right, last time out, Nottingham Forest, the 2-0 yes. win. Good for... Because they, they were on a bit of form before. Oh, oh talking to Forrest, Alioski outside the box yeah, there. Yeah, very good goal as well. We're in perfect Funnily timing. Enough, I watched um, a fella who does like the audio descriptive um, 
commentaries yeah. for Nottingham Forest. If you've seen it on YouTube, he's, he, he, he did a little, lovely little vlog um, and he was thinking it'd be a close game or something he was saying and it was nice to see like see his sort of perspective of the game. But um, Leeds, great, another great result on yeah, the road. Fantastic, fantastic. Um, obviously going 1-0 up, it looked shaky and then the Alioski goal put all nerves to to rest really but yeah what a win and just how good a lead on the road at the moment they just need to sort out their form at Ellen Road a bit which is what it was, it was kind of the reverse almost last season well kind of there were points on the road for Gary Monk's side but at the beginning of the season it seemed like Ellen Road might be uh, not as much as the fortress but then it did become the fortress didn't where are it? you going I just realised what I'm doing um, yeah I think you know you got to bear in mind under Monk early days nowhere was Good for Leeds. They couldn't pick up points absolutely anywhere. No! Uh, oh my god! Um, <laughs> if you kind of just but, intermittently watching this and listening to it, and then you just heard that, and we're like, "What's gone on?" It was a bit of a tame thing for me to scream at. But yeah, it's Burton. Remember, I mean, I'm not expecting like a huge result here. Expect expect more. It's our ball. You daft! Oh my god. Um, we were talking about Forest. Forest. Yeah, good result. Yeah, good. <laughs> a good conversation, thank you. Uh, also, Leeds yeah, are, uh, are going to be on the telly again, a they? bunch, because uh, What's Sky Sports on? Leeds of uh, Sorry, Sky Sports uh, Football. Oh, it's Calvin. Um, no! Have... Uh, uh, oh, oh, I missed! Oh. 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 If the Leeds fans that don't like Calvin Phillips now, and he did that... Oh, I've missed. They would hate him. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <sighs> how? Just how? Win that. Well, then. But, uh, yeah, it's good to just see a Leeds team. Like, watching Forest, obviously, you know, um, just away from home, how good Leeds are, how just entertaining they are, and they're getting the results for it as well. Does the television fixtures sort of weigh in on Leeds? Do you think a wee bit? Because, like I said, they've been they've moved a, another game and they're on the telly. I think a couple more times. Yeah. Uh, in November and September, uh, October and um, sorry, September and October. Yeah. I lost track of the dates. Uh, yeah, you don't know what's going on, do you? Oh, it's our ball. Oh, what is going on? No. But um, yeah, I don't mind too much because Leeds are actually all right this season. So you're on telly and you know Leeds are winning, so, which is always good. I always found that whenever Leeds were on telly, they were losing. But then in fairness, whenever Leeds just played football, they were losing most of the time. <laughs> so I don't think telly had anything to do with it. But yeah, but it's the good. Thing, the reason I'm, I'm, I'm suggesting it, it does it, uh, well, not even suggesting, I'm asking if it maybe weighs in, is because, I don't know, do you, do you feel like, the, I want to know if the players maybe up the performance or not, maybe for the telly. Probably not. I think it's just the fact that it's there, just the fact that Leeds have started well and conveniently Leeds are always on TV. Um, I don't think so, but yeah, at the same time... Um, I'm making some changes. It's just annoying. I think it's more annoying for fans, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Especially now that 20,000 season tickets have been sold. You know, yeah. Ellen Road could, is definitely a great place to be. I think there's 30,000 expected. I'm putting this guy on for his hair. Um, I don't even think he's there anymore, but yeah, go for it. Um... And I think it's one of those things of like 30,000 are expected here and it's just a bit of a shame that they're on the telly so much at the moment. Yeah, but... Maybe. Well, I don't think it's... Effect- Even at Allen Road, it's obviously not affecting Leeds' attendance. It's 30,000 plus going to be there for Burton Albion, mm-hmm. which, when you think about it, it's Burton Albion at home. That's very impressive. Very impressive. Come on, come on. Come Overall, though, Mark made a bold statement on the Yorkshire Football Show the other week. Hello. And he was Thank saying... He suggested that the championship is perhaps not as quality as it was last season. Now, I'm not so sure about that. I don't know. I think the championship just keeps getting better and better and better. Same. It's the fact that you're just taking out the likes of Newcastle, Brighton and that, who are always always up, up there. Or well, obviously Newcastle, who we expected to be up there. But Brighton, who were always up there. Huddersfield, who had a shock season but were great, let's be fair to them. And they got promoted. Um, oh, no. Um, but no I still think it's tough it's just more the fact that it's open this year you don't have a Newcastle and Brighton who were expecting we were kind of expecting to make up the top two they're gone so it's um, it's still it's probably more difficult this year because of the uncertainty around it I was going to say where's the advantage it's a disgrace 
Yeah, I don't agree with uh, Mark's point there. But let us know what you think about, obviously, the championship this season. I don't think that the quality is sort of less this season. You've still got your Wednesdays. You've still got your Fulham. And even <laughs> Villa. To exactly. Extent. Exactly. It's corner. Did that come off anyone? No. Oh. What did I say? Well, I get, you got to have a go from 40 yards, didn't you? What's the point if not? <laughs> oh! Good tackle, that. No, see, I was, I was doing a 1-2 oh, there. I was doing a 1-2. That's exactly, you just go for it. I can't believe this is 1-1. I so can't believe you've not had a man, man sent off. Why would you say that? Because you... Honestly? Yeah? You're a horrible, dirty Actually, player. <laughs> I don't know what you're on about, mate. Sorry. I don't know what you're on about. No, oh, come on. Come on, too many men forward. Great, ah. great tackle. What? You see, another slide tackle. You, yeah. you are What's slide, the issue? You're worse What's the issue? I won the ball. You are a horrible FIFA player at times. Ah. I saw the flag, so I thought I'd just lever it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do. Do I drop? Do I drop back? Try and go for the get a point. I'm Burton, obviously. I don't know. Would a point at Ellen Road be okay? Oh, 100 percent for Burton Albion, yeah. But I think you should go all out attack and let me score. No. Oh my! Oh, hello. Oh no, he's so slow. Yes! Oh, what a way that'd be for your debut. Into the corner out there. That was that was northwest down there. That was nowhere near the corner. I'm pretty sure that was quite central, Tom. No, I meant run into the corner. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant the, the ball. Right, okay. Get back to my celebration. Yes! Oh, look at this. Bang! No, it wasn't. That's your season-long loan fee paid right there. Do you reckon? Well, I don't think so. I don't think you've paid, I think anything. Bit, I think you've paid anything for it. Oh, right, just, right. just here. So, oh, yeah. Come along. Get in. I need to what I didn't do last time and defend the lead. Ah! All right, Gary, chill out. Gary Neville, if you didn't get it. Oh, I thought you were referencing something about Monk that I didn't know. Four minutes, get four it. minutes to save these points. Oh, it's five, actually. No, it says four, down there. It says four and 10, so 14 minutes, there you go. Oh, hey! Not good with coin flips. I'd have liked to have played as Leeds today. Would you? That's yeah. a shame you should have won the coin flip, wouldn't you? Is that going to go out for a corner? No, but we'll take it. Your guy's just standing there. Just to Why is he still the there? world? <laughs> I couldn't change to him either. Oh, come on. Come on, Burton. Come on, the Brewers. Oh, not like this. Not like this. Won the ball. I won the ball! Oh my word! You didn't I won the, the ball. ball! You didn't! I won the ball! Tom, what universe are you living in? Where I won the ball, that one! Do we need to go on instant replay? I won the ball, I don't know because I know I won the ball. You're a disgrace, dive. I might even cut this out, but, oh, yeah. yeah I'm definitely, gonna gonna do, yeah, definitely gonna cut it out now. Let's have a look at this. Right, yeah. Oh, what am I doing? You go, you go wrong. <laughs> it's playing the ball game. Let's just say. Right, ready, 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 ready. Man first. One at the ball. You don't want me first. win the ball. Man first. One at the ball. It was what? the man first, what a, Tom. You better score from all this analysis. You had a man sent off. No, I didn't. You did. <laughs> what for? It's, he was the one that was just stood in the corner doing nothing. What's going on? I don't understand that. Right, here we go. Run in! No! Oh, no, 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 no. Away, away, away. Why are you doing it over at kick in the box? Dude! Come on! No! Yes! Ah! Yes! yes! <laughs> Lead struggle against Burn at home. Ah! Good game, though. I enjoyed that. <sighs> That's tense. Anyway, so you can join us for Legion United Live on uh, Radio Yorkshire, DAB, Redders, Stats, and Mark. Um, quick... Uh, you never had a player sent off. I don't understand. I'm so confused. But it said you did. 
It's Illuminati, confirm that. Um, Legion United Live on Saturday. Um, one thirty, we start our commentary. Now, Tom, no, if you, you t- if, Leeds, if Leeds <laughs> win... Forget about the red card. Okay. Right? okay. 2-1, at home, yeah. you absolutely take it. But uh, yeah. everyone seems to be expecting a better result. If it's like that where I had to kind of scrape through it yeah. and then defend with my life really <laughs> nervously at the end, then yeah, I'd probably be a bit annoyed. But who knows? I am rubbish at FIFA, let's not forget. But you had a man sent off and I don't recall this. I don't recall the man being sent off. If you uh, saw that man getting sent off, uh, give us a like or a uh, or a comment, something like that. What does what it YouTube say? Smash that like button. Yeah. Uh, anyway, we'll be back. And they'll be like that. Let us know how the play the got sent off. Yeah. Bye bye merch and all that. Anyway, Tom, it's been all right. Yeah, it's been good. I'm just confused now. Bye everyone. <laughs>